Center approaching Fallow Field. The red line will be getting some love in the spring. Riders like Jeff Dewar are trying to stay positive. I mean, it'll be a pain. It'll be a pain in the butt for a little bit, but uh, I, I think it'll be well worth it in the long run. The T tracks of the red line provide service to about 12,000 daily riders between the South Hills, downtown, and the North Shore. The Port Authority says these tracks have reached the end of its life. Starting in mid March, the red line will be closed due to rail repairs starting here at Fallowfield Avenue in Beachview and ending here at Potomac Avenue in Dormont. A mile stretch of rail that has been repaired 22 times since 2008 to keep it open. We have to keep, there's been significant repairs required there. We've been, you know, patching it, patching it. It's time now and just in, uh, to. To do the repair. Street pavement in the center lanes of Broadway Avenue and Beachview also need replaced. Some riders say they're discouraged. It's a big stretch right there because there's a lot of people that live in that area. I know that ride that trolley. If they have to work on it to make it better, that's a good idea as long as they still have transportation for the people to get back and forth. And that's what the Port Authority will be doing. We have shuttles. So you'll get off, you'll pick up a shuttle, it'll drop you at the bottom, you get back on again. The project was supposed to last through two construction seasons, but the Port Authority cut it down to six months by providing the contractor a financial incentive. Officials hope it can be completed ahead of schedule, and riders like Helen Troutman of Mount Lebanon are taking it in stride. It's something you have to do. It's uh, the nature of the business. Amy Wattis, KDK TV News.